Hey friends, hello, good morning, and happy Saturday. I am opening up the vlog with you guys a day late. Um, normally I like to open up the vlog with you guys on Fridays and share what our Fridays look like. Um, usually it's in the afternoon anyway, and I'm showing you hamburgers and stuff like that, but um, I'm opening it up with you a little bit later because there wasn't a ton to show you yesterday. Um, I had kind of a busy work day, and Sean is actually in Idaho right now. He uh, actually has taken our first official load to Idaho. Now we don't have a home yet, uh, but Sean's mom lives in Idaho and um, she was so gracious enough to allow us to um, hold some of the things at her house that we don't want movers touching and things like that. So um, it's nice to like, the, now it's feeling real. <laughs> it's like, oh man. So we loaded up the truck, was that Wednesday? Yeah, we loaded up the truck on Wednesday and he took a load to his mom's. He is actually on his way home now. Um, so it was a quick trip. It was literally just go there, drop the things, spend the evening and then come back. So um, he is on his way back. He should probably be back be sometime between one and two o'clock this afternoon. He's gonna be tired. <laughs> He's gonna be very tired, but yeah, so we have our first official load out of the house, which is crazy. Um, we are going to be hiring movers, but there's certain things, you know, like family pictures and things like that, that we don't want movers to be touching. So um, that's why he asked his mom if we could keep some things at her house for the time being. So um, so she's holding on to our stuff. So thanks, Priscilla. <laughs> um, so yeah, there wasn't, since he wasn't around, there wasn't really anything that was too exciting to share with you. Um, I did have my pre-op appointment on, was that Thursday? On Thursday. So I'm going to do a little story time with Lisa with you guys um, here in just a little bit. I'm actually getting ready to run out and um, drop off an order. The dogs are super excited that um, dad's coming home today, huh? Because <laughs> I'm boring, huh? I'm boring. Yes. <laughs> um, but yeah, so... Um, I'm gonna drop an order and then come back. I've got some work that I'm doing today in my VIP group and um, So once I get back from dropping my order, I'll probably sit down and chit chat with you guys about my pre-op appointment You guys we are just a little over a week away from my surgery. It's crazy when you watch this We're just gonna be a couple days away, which is so crazy. So uh, my surgery is on the 21st and I have to tell you like my pre-op appointment just really made me feel so much more comfortable and like ready to go I love my surgeon. She's absolutely amazing, but um yeah, before I totally get into what I'm gonna say in a little bit, um, I just wanted to pick up the camera and say hi to you guys and open up the vlog. So welcome to the vlog, friends. Not to worry, it's not gonna be entire an entire vlog of um, story time with Lisa because my man is on his way home. He will be tired, but he will be home. So, and we'll see if he has a fun fact. I'm sure he will. Even tired, I'm sure he will be prepared with a fun fact. So, all right, I'm gonna head out drop off this order and then head on back and get some more work done. So welcome to the vlog friends. All right, you guys, so I'm checking in with you later. I was able to go and run some errands and stuff. And now um, Sean is actually home. So we are going to welcome him home. My favorite part of him coming home after a few days being gone is seeing the dogs react to him. So we'll see how that goes. We'll also see if he has a fun fact. We'll see, I'm sure he does. Oh, hello, sir. Hello. <laughs> Just a quick trip to Idaho. By way of Oregon. By way of Oregon. Oh, hello. Hello. <laughs> hello. Hello. Are you real? How about a guessing game? Ooh, I like guessing games. How many miles did I drive in two days? I'm really bad at this. Um, I'm going to say a thousand. A little more than a thousand. One thousand. Three hundred. Point. <laughs> Two. <laughs> All right. Well, there you have it. Two days. <laughs> All right. Let's get the dogs. Hello. He's like, I knew it. <laughs> I knew it. <laughs> I know, Dad's home. Yes, I know. Truck's there. 
Oh, yes. Oh, go get the truck. Truck. Uh oh. We'll take somebody out. <laughs> oh, yes. They missed you. They're over Hallmark movies. I bet. <laughs> okay, so Sean went to go shower. So this gives me a little bit of time to share a little story time with Lisa regarding my, um, my pre-op appointment that took place on Thursday. Oh, I am so happy. I'm really happy. I'm so confident in my surgeon and it was an amazing appointment. Like by the end of the appointment, if she was like, we're going to do this today, then um, I would have been like, let's do this. She was just very confident and she was just like telling me like the procedure and how um, we expect things to go and how like Sometimes things don't go according to plan, but if A, B, and C happens, then we're going to do X, Y, and Z and all of this and just like really what to expect kind of. And um, of course, everybody's different and, you know, things could come up, complications and things like that can come up, but I am in a positive mindset <laughs> that everything is going to go perfect and smooth as silk. Um, I did get, so it's going to be outpatient and, um, the only reason why I would need to stay the night is if there's any kind of complications or if I'm like the last, like if there's like issues with somebody else's surgery and I'm not the first one of the day and it winds up being late, um, then I would need to be like supervised overnight. But, um, that's like a very like not common situation. So it should be outpatient. Um, I am still hoping that I will be the first one of the day. <laughs> so that way, the surgeon is bright eyed and bushy tailed and ready to take on the day. And hopefully I'm not, you know, her second one. I don't think they do that many surgeries. I actually meant to ask her how many of these surgeries they do in a day, but, um, here's hoping I'm the first, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> um, so, and then I also got a little kit that I'm, I'm actually going to show, I was going to unbox it with you. I don't know. Maybe I'll do it. It's, it's all the way over on the counter. <laughs> so I actually haven't even opened it, but, um, it's got my pre-op and post-op instructions. It also has this like mysterious surgery drink that I need to drink two hours before within 15 minutes. So I have to drink the drink in 15 minutes, but I have to drink it two hours before surgery, which is kind of strange. So, um, I, there's no bowel prep or anything like that, by the way, sorry if this is TMI, I guess I should have said this like at the beginning of this, uh, little story time segment, but, um, there's no bowel prep or anything. I'm going to go more into a lot more detail on, on the appointment as well as why we decided to, to go with the hysterectomy route and what led us up until this point, um, in my actual hysterectomy series that I'm going to be starting let's see if you are watching this next weekend it probably went up this last week because my goal is to have it up this next week which for you will have been last week so oh my gosh it's time it's time for the hysterectomy series so um i'm hoping to have it up on tuesday which is exactly one week until surgery so i'm going to go into more detail on that but um yeah i just have to stop eating uh at midnight or eight hours before surgery and then are you okay you made noise. It's okay. We're not living in, in the quiet place smoothie. You won't die. <laughs> um, and then this drink, I'm so intrigued by this drink. So leave a comment. If you have had to take this mysterious carbonated drink, um, I hope it just tastes like sparkling water. Cause if so, I'm here for it. Um, so we'll see. But yeah, so do that. And then, like I said, it's supposed to be outpatient and yeah, I'm going to be good to go. It's going to be fantastic. So there is that. There's my like kind of sort of, sh oh, gosh, that was short. It's only like four minutes. I feel like there, I'm sure there's something I'm leaving out. This was been kind of like a whirlwind of a day. Um, had a lot of work and stuff to get done. Now Sean's home. I'm so excited. Uh, we're going to do tacos for dinner tonight because it's nice and easy. Um, he had pizza last night for dinner. So that's why we decided to do tacos tonight because it's nice and easy. We have a pretty easy couple of days scheduled for just like relaxing and and all that and getting ready for the week ahead sean's last week of work for the year yes. and that. and my last week before surgery so got a lot to get done but we will get it all done and it's going to be amazing and we are going to have lots of trips up to ups <laughs> because we've got lots of things to send out so um yeah so there you have it there's my little update for you 
and like I said if you are interested in more details about the surgery and what I'm doing to prepare I'm going to show you the things that I have purchased um, prior to surgery that hopefully will help me things that were suggested to me things that were gifted to me um, so that way if it helps you that, that'll all be in that series for anyone who's interested in that that way you know if you're not interested in that you don't have to listen to it so all right Sean is going to grind grind up what is it called great up great up some cheese. He's the one that's been driving for 75,000 miles. Not me. I've been a single mom, okay? Yeah. Uh, one of the conversations I had with myself, well, okay. <laughs> uh, realized that we need to get you new license, we need to get new license plate frames because you're not a director. Oh, I'm not. You're right. I'm a star director. That's okay. We'll get them with our new license plates. First order of business when we move to Idaho is change our license plates yeah. from California to Idaho. Take them off as soon as we get there. So we don't get egged. <laughs> For all of our I our Idaho friends, like, don't hate us. <laughs> we take up very little room, I promise. And we're the nice Californians. All right, so we're going to get ready for dinner, which is tacos. I will show you a little bit of that. You, I think you just saw this like not that long ago. It's not super exciting, but I'll still show you. So there's a little story time with Lisa. You are welcome. I still have the vlog to finish. That's going up tomorrow. It should go up in the morning, but... We'll see how that goes. Zoe, you got a case of sad, boo? Yeah, you're sad because I didn't drop anything. So <laughs> All right, we have our taco dinner, <clears throat> and we have Squeaky's back. You thought his name was Pointy. <laughs> it's actually Squeaky. Oh, man, I have missed your squeaky toes. <laughs> okay, so we've got our taco situation here. I do little street tacos with corn tortilla shells, some avocado, and then Sean has his flour tortilla burrito taco situation with Miracle Whip, Tapatio, and Crushed Up Dorito. Yay, yay. All right, we're going to eat, and then I've got some work to do on the vlog. Hey, friends. Good Hello. Morning. Good morning. Hello. Hello. Hello from the Roberries on this beautiful, rainy Sunday morning. I was thinking the other day, I don't know when the last time you guys actually got to experience a dog walk because it's been raining or we've been gone and things have been going on. So, uh, what? No one's been asking for one. <laughs> no one's been yeah, asking for any. The people have spoken and you don't like the Roberry talks anymore, apparently. No. Who could not love this face? Who could not love this face? I know. I know. It's okay. It's okay. You have to love this face. <laughs> Anyways, we are getting ready for the vlog premiere with you guys. We are back to mornings today and then next weekend but next weekend is when you're watching this this weekend when you're watching this is actually going to be the last vlog for just a little bit just a couple of weeks i think um just because of surgery and stuff and i don't know how i'm going to be able to like edit and stuff so i'm um, just taking a short little break there but um we are loving this day today it is rainy it is a nice cozy day to stay inside we are doing chili for dinner tonight and i am so excited if you have seen our chili it is amazing and we make this we sean makes this delicious cornbread recipe that is to die for so um I am here for it. So we have kind of, kind of sort of a lazy day. We're going to kind of recoup from the week last week, which was super busy. We've got a really busy week up and coming because it is the week before surgery. So we've got a lot of stuff to get done. So we're going to take today to ourselves. So there may not be a ton of exciting stuff to show you, but I uh, figured I'd at least pick up the camera and say hello. We are still going to do the Q and A. We are still going to do what's Lisa smelling um, because that's going to be the last ones for a couple of weeks anyway. So um, anyways, Hi friends, happy Sunday. And don't forget about Zoe. Zoe, are you having a lazy day? Are you having a lazy day? It started. Day? Oh, it started. It started. Why don't I have any uh, music? Hold on, what's happening? There we go. Your ears are charged. Are your ears charged? All right, we're gonna chat with you guys. Music. Music. Yo DJ, spin that. Ish. <laughs> hey, friends. Oh, family friendly. Hello. Whoa, yeah. Hello. <laughs> Hi, friends. It is time for Q and A with the Roberries. As I mentioned this morning, we have just been hanging out. Sean got his nap today. I did. Made up for lost time. You did. I did. <laughs> right. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. Well, hello and welcome back to everyone's favorite talk show within a vlog on YouTube, Roberry Q and A. Woo! I like that intro. Yeah, that, we, we, got, we, got, we got we got things to do. We got, we got to do. supper to make. Yes, uh, we've just really we got two 
uh, two that came in and then uh, a little extended this or that round with Ari. So this will go quick. But do we have some house cleaning or yes, products we, or whatnot? Yes, we do. And we forgot your other tagline where you, you've got Roberry Q and A. <laughs> well, no, I thought where you've got questions. And we've got answers. I thought it's reversed. Okay. I thought. All right, Roberry Q and A, where you've got questions. And we've got answers. There it is. Woo! <laughs> Submit your vote below to let us know which way you prefer. Oh my goodness. Okay, uh, a couple of house cleaning for me. Uh, my, I guess, product, Corporation of the week is going to be Chevron. Chevron. Oh yeah, <laughs> all, the driving. <laughs> all the driving. All the driving. Fourteen hundred miles in a couple of days. So it was. Uh, it was a lot. Luckily, that truck really only needed uh, the old diesel a couple of times. So it's pretty mind blowing how far you can get on uh, a tank of gas. Or That's what I was going to say. Diesel. Yeah, tank of diesel. Because yeah, I was going to say that because I think a lot of people see like big trucks as oh my gosh, it gets terrible gas mileage unless you have diesel <laughs> because uh, was, diesel is like. It's amazing it really on nice. the gas mileage because you probably only had to fill up what once or twice because you. Yeah, I mean I once, didn't give you a once I got up to um, Oregon and then. Because when you left, was it like a half tank or something? Uh, no, it was a little bit more than that. Uh -huh. uh, anyway, and then my other real product of the week, uh, when I was up there at my mom and stepdad's, he uh, ended up buying me a knife, a knife for uh, like camping, hunting, it's fishing. It's so nice. It's actually really nice. A handmade knife. With the uh, you know from antler there, super uh, cool. yeah, super cool. Very sharp, uh, good quality. I mean, it, it's it's very heavy. Yeah, nicely done. It's very impressive. Nice little sheath with it. Very cool. Can't wait to put it to use. Hopefully, <laughs> well, at least I can get a trout with it or something. There you go. Get a trout. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Jeez. He's yeah. already in Idaho, folks. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I'll leave it there. All okay, right. Do you well, have anything? Um, I do. So a couple of things. Um, my product is packing tape <laughs> because as you guys know, we are packing like crazy, um, especially now that like we are coming down to the final countdown here before surgery. So we've got, it's a nice excuse. What? <laughs> I know. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, if, if you know, you know, if yeah. you go down the reels rabbit hole, then you know. Um, anyways. Yeah. So <laughs> Let's see what's happening. Uh, we're we're doing as much as we can before surgery is what I'm trying to say. But also, we had a pretty awesome sale in my VIP group, and so we are going to be doing lots of shipping over this next week. So yeah. packing tape is going to be amazing. Uh, the other thing that I wanted to address because I feel like I can't remember if I actually said it this morning before the premiere or not. I thought about it, so I may have said it. So if I'm saying it again, I do apologize. Um, this vlog that you're actually watching is going to be the last vlog for a couple of weeks. We will still be picking up and vlogging again, um, but just I want to, I, I don't know how it's going to look after surgery. I'm going to be vlogging my recovery and all of that, but that's going to be its own separate series for anyone who's like not interested in like the TMI details of, of stuff with recovery. But your Roberries are still going to be weekend vlogging. I know a lot of people were concerned when we announced that we're moving. They're like, oh my gosh, are you not going to be on YouTube anymore? Are you not going to be vlogging this and that? We are still going to be vlogging. So, um, we just may need a couple of weeks before we get back into like a regular routine of things. So not to worry, you won't see us for like a couple of weeks, but we will be back. Until next year. I know. Yeah, yeah it's true. We'll see you in 2022. Happy New Year, y'all. 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 Hey, y'all. Hey, y'all. All right, let's have some fun, shall we? Let's. All right, this first one is from our friend. With that being said, still have your questions coming in. So like like I said, we are still going to be doing the, the vlog and the Q&A and all of that. So just feel like even though we aren't vlogging for a couple of weeks, still send in your questions because if you don't, then we won't have another Q&A. <laughs> yeah, this next one's going to be super short. <laughs> so here we are going to kick it off with our friend Laura. Hi, Laura. Hello, kicking it off with Laura. Hello. Ooh, hello. 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 <laughs> She's... Uh, just watching the Thanksgiving vlog and had some really nice stuff to say about the game and then the JFK uh, footage that we went down there in downtown Dallas. She was curious about my my man cave or my uh, called like my gun room and wanted to see if we would show that. Unfortunately, I already broke everything down. Uh, that was probably one of the first things once we yeah. decided to move. Uh, I started breaking everything down out of there. So once we get up to Idaho and get settled in. Uh, I'll show you um, if you get, yeah, if you guys are interested in it. Uh, several workbenches and uh, spot for reloading am ammo, and I got a big old American flag that's like the size of a wall. And, yeah. <laughs> um, so yeah, pretty cool stuff. Uh, so we just missed it, but 
if you are interested in it, then we'll do that once we get up there. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Um, yeah. Cause it, like that was like the quickest, he was like, he just broke everything down. So yeah. literally it's just an empty room. So, um, and we knew that like, we weren't going to, he wasn't going to be reloading or we weren't going to be needing that stuff right away. So we just packed it, packed it all up, but we'll do like a whole like house tour and stuff. I'm sure. So you'll have that to look forward to. Is that it? That's it. Thanks so much, Laura. Whoop, whoop. Ooh, that was a good one. Good job, Ranger. Aw, Ranger. <laughs> All right, this next and last one's from our friend. <laughs> next and last is from our friend. Is this Caitlin? Yes, it so is. Nay. Okay, Caitlin. Hello, Caitlin. Yeah, I... Hello. He was he was speedy. He's a little bit my, cranky. My A goes up, down, and then from Like a the star. Bottom. Yeah, to the center. Like a Dallas uh, star. Yeah. Aw. All right. Uh, let's see here. First question is... For oh. oh, she has a couple questions. Yes, two questions in the email. Okay. Uh, for Miss Lisa, if there was any place in the world that you could travel to for vacation, where would you go? I want to go to Italy. Italy. I want to go to Italy. I think that'd be super fun. Somewhere out of the country, but not like too crazy. Those Italians, no. <laughs> no, you know. <laughs> I I feel like we'd never come home. Yeah. We would eat our way through Italy and never come back. <laughs> that, that would be really nice. Yeah, I would agree with that too. Although she didn't ask my opinion, but I'm giving it anyway. <laughs> I'm giving it anyway. <clears throat> and then the second question is for me, what's my favorite uh, recipe to cook? And I will say, uh, again, my spaghetti and chicken parm is probably my, my favorite. I think, depending on that. how next weekend goes, I guess, since we're not vlogging, you guys won't see it anyway, so you, but <laughs> it'll be on Instagram. Yeah, there you there go. You go. Follow us on Instagram for our current meal situations. But yeah. depending on what she chooses next week, because she's all dramatic. Like, oh my God, I want, I want carbonara. I want this. If if something goes bad in the in, in the <laughs> surgery, then at least I had this as my last meal, and blah 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 blah. Because I've had a surgery. I had a, a serious surgery before, and that was the same <clears> thing. I was like. All right, this is my last meal. My last meal before that was chicken pot pie. I remember it because I was like, uh, <laughs> I, want, I want this. Just in case I die in surgery, yep. then I can say that I, I died with my last meal being an amazing one, which so, they're all amazing. So basically. depending on what she chooses, I might try to sneak that in next yeah. weekend before your surgery because then, uh, you know how we do with leftovers, but especially with the spaghetti leftovers, oh, it'll, it'll last me all the way through her recovery. So good. So then she can have her soup and I can have my uh, I would just, I would just say not spaghetti. the night before, only because I tend to be a little bit thirsty after and where I can't drink anything the next morning. So, but yeah, definitely. Oh, spaghetti. Oh, the spaghetti is so good. So, so yeah, yeah, let's plan on it. Let's do it. Perfect. That's it. Thank you so much. Thanks so much, Caitlin. Whoop, whoop. Oh, gosh. <laughs> Failing at life. There we go. All right. Let's Wrap it round with Ari. Wrap it this or that round. This or that. Ex this or that. Extended version. Extended version. All right. Let's see here. I better get a sip here. Did you guys know that there's a zebra in my cup? There is. And she sold her zebra Aww. warmer. It's so awesome. Shh, we can't talk about that. Oh. Just Cut. kidding. <laughs> I, I saw. <laughs> just. I saw one online. Um, just kidding. Corporate. <laughs> All right. <laughs> this or that round with Ari. Ready? Ready. All right. Uh, car bar clip or car bar? Car bar. Car bar. My, uh, my vents, I have to explain. It's rapid, but it's fine. My vents are like kind of weird, so I can't just like do the clip. Caddy wampus. Caddy wampus, if you will. And I will. Uh, scent, circle, scent pack. Scent circle. Uh, I'll go scent pack. NFL collection warmers or NFL collection mini warmers? I would say mini warmers because I really like the the little like gameplay that that shows on the back. You're gonna say full size. Full size. Sensi club monthly, bi monthly, or quarterly? Monthly. monthly. <laughs> yeah. Give me all the Sensi clubs. Yeah. Floral scents or woodsy scents? Floral. Um, Woodsy. Woodsy. Bakery or scent or spice? Is that even a question? Bakery. Spice. No. <laughs> Citrus or fruity scents? Citrus. Ah, it's hard. I'm gonna go fruity. I'm gonna go citrus. Because that's your blue grotto. The citrus. And there's another little one called Oodles of Orange. It's also citrus. Uh, yep, sure yep. is. <laughs> uh, orange creamsicle or tangerine creamsicle? 
Tangerine creamsicle. I th kind of. They're, they're probably the. the they're exact not same. the exact same. Exact same. They are not the exact same. Yeah. Uh, yeah, they're the exact same, so you can go with either. Uh, I'll go tangerine too. Uh, Bright cider life or cedar cider? Bright cider life. Mm, yep, I'll go with that. If you would have told me, I would have had them here for you to sniff. Pumpkin roll or scary good? Oh, that's hard. Um, scary good. Okay, very well. Yes. Uh, scarlet sunflower or here comes the sun flowers. flowers. Um, scarlet sunflower. Excellent choice. Uh, blue grotto or blue raspberry ice? Blue grotto. Blue grotto. Blueberry cheesecake or blueberry rush? Ooh. It depends on the mood I'm in. Blueberry cheesecake. How about the mood that you're in right now? Blueberry cheesecake. Blueberry cheesecake. <laughs> uh, cookies for Santa? Uh, nope. Michelle? Or Saint Knickerdoodle? Ah, oh, Saint Knickerdoodle. That's, I mean, anything would have won up against cookies for Santa. <laughs> I, I'm just one of the weirdos that gets a sour milk note, so I'll take... Basically anything else out of, out of that. I'll have you smell it later. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, we not. Yeah. <laughs> but I mean, I for, if you love it, I'm so there's a lot of people who don't get the sour milk note, and I'm envious of you. I wish my sniffer did not pick up any like weird sour milk note in there. But um, yeah, so there's my explanation. Okay. Last one. Last one. Eggnog. Yes. Or spiced eggnog. Spiced eggnog. I know. Oh, seriously, egg, the eggnog scent that Sensi came out with um, a while back from from the Sense of the Season collection was so good, and so I was good. hoping I was hoping that so spiced good. eggnog was going to be amazing in the bricks, and it's way better. Mm -hmm. What? Way better. She said, "Way better." Way better. What? 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 All right. Immediately went into my club. Okay, that's it. That's it. Thanks so much, Ari. Whoop whoop. All right, so seriously, if you have a question nice. that you would like for us to answer, like I said, it will be a couple of weeks, but we will be back and we will be doing the Q&A. Feel free to send them in no matter when it is at roberryvlog at gmail.com. If you want to see what we're up to, I will be, um, I, yeah, up here we, we have our Instagram handles above our heads. We will be um, storying what we're doing cook-wise, recovery-wise, just life in general, we will be sharing it over on Instagram. So be sure to follow us to see what's going on with the Roberries while we're taking a couple weeks off from the old YouTubes. Yep, it's gonna be, oh yeah, from YouTube from and, and from work. It's gonna be a little preview of my life to come. Oh my goodness, <laughs> congratulations. <laughs> Same good stuff. All right, friends. Thank you so much. All right, take us away. Take us away. And we're not gonna hear this until next year. Bye bye. Bye bye. It's on YouTube. You can play it anytime. You want. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Now that we have wrapped up the last Roberry Q and A for 2021, we are going to be getting dinner together. So we are doing chili, as I mentioned earlier. Uh, the chili kit. You guys have seen this if you've been hanging around with us. Um, the chili kit that we use is the Carol Shelby's chili kit. So we actually double this, so we have lots and lots and lots of leftovers. Um, and then we also, instead of just all ground beef, we actually do um, ground beef and sausage. It's delicious. So um, you will watch us put this together. What I do want to let you know, this shirt <laughs> is not going to get ruined by chili. So if you see me change my sweatshirt into a black one, I promise you it is still on the same day. I didn't do any editing tricks like I did last week. Um, <laughs> it is still the same day. I just don't want chili splatter on my light color sweatshirt. So, all right, I gotta go help my husband get off the floor. <laughs> Are you gonna be okay? <laughs>
All right, chili night is underway at the Rowberries. We have topped our bowls of chili with some delicious cheese, of course. So good. Is this not focusing? This isn't focusing. Retake. Take two. Take two. All right, we've got delicious chili night underway here at the Rowberries, and this looks incredible. With delicious cheese on top, of course. Delicious cheese on top, of course. And then we've got this delicious... Uh, cheesy cornbread situation and of course we have our oh look at you all fancy and stuff and working smarter not harder uh, we also have our chili cheese fritos that we're going to sprinkle on top and enjoy so we're going to go do this and watch some football Let's go Cowboys. Let's go. Football. Hey friends, hello, good morning, and a happy Monday from rainy, rainy California. So still no dog walk today. Um, I feel like the dogs are going a little bit stir crazy, but also they don't love when the sky is falling either. <laughs> they like, the Ranger is currently in the, in the situation where he's like, yeah, no, I really don't have to go potty that bad when the sky is falling. <laughs> so uh, anyways, figured I'd pick up the camera and say hello. Um, we have quite a few things planned for today in terms of like productivity. Um, we are getting ready to go drop the truck off at the dealership to go get the oil changed. So we're gonna do that. Um, and then I think we're gonna grab some breakfast while we're out and then come back and work on some house stuff. So we're gonna move some more things into the garage since now we have more space since Sean took the first load to Idaho already. Um, we're gonna move some more things out because this is the last week that I'll be able to lift anything um, heavy for a little bit. So we're gonna do what we can with that. Um, yeah, that's pretty much what we have planned. We will be doing what's Lisa smelling. So wish me luck. <laughs> we'll see how it goes. Um, but yeah, but I just wanted to pick up the camera and say hello and good morning. And I will check in with you here in just a little while. And my lanterns are all over the dang place. <laughs> um, so I'll be picking those up later, but there's no point in picking it up now and just have them blow back over again. But um, yeah, as soon as the rain dies down, I'll be picking up all those lanterns. <laughs> all right, y'all, so we have dropped off the truck and we are pulling up to breakfast. It's a big surprise. Sean likes to, we're going to the Gold Miner Cafe. Okay. Is that it? That's it. Nice. We, I've never been there. Have you, have you? Uh, I've only been there once. Oh, wow. So we are going to try a new breakfast experience. So come have breakfast with us. Here we are, Tiffany and Kay's Gold Miner Cafe. Let's go eat. All right, so morning supper is done and it was so good. It's so, so good. It's one of those like little spots that like everybody knows everybody and it was really, really good. But, um, so thank you so much. Oh, you're very welcome. Um, we also want to show you this situation of a Mustang <laughs> that is happening over here. So Michelle, if you're watching this, you need to do this to your car or anybody else who is a super fan of Christmas, you need to do this to your car. Wrapping paper. <laughs> Wrapping paper on the hood of this car. <laughs> now that's the Christmas spirit. <laughs> <laughs> hey friends doing an afternoon check-in with you i look rough it's fine it's fine nobody cares <laughs> um but we have been super super busy super productive over here um sean is the most amazing husband ever and he took some boxes for me up to ups and have those sent out and buy more boxes and stuff. So he is actually on his way home. I, okay, for reals, for reals, for reals. You guys are probably tired of hearing me say this, but I think I'm gonna get him this time. I really honestly don't think he's expecting me to record him coming home. So I don't think he's gonna have a fun fact. 
<laughs> it is like my goal in life to catch him unprepared, but the man just stays ready. He really does. So we'll see. Um, but yeah, I've just been busy. He, Sean was working in the garage. Um, and the garage looks absolutely amazing. Um, I think when the movers come, they're just going to be like, Oh man, <laughs> like this is the easiest job we've got. Um, it's super organized, super neat and tidy and it looks great. Um, and then I've just been working on Sensi stuff here. Um, I'm going to be going to be working on Sensi stuff basically all this week um, because the stitch buddies are finally here and ready to go. So I've got that stuff to mail out. And then from my personal sale of my personal stock, um, I am mailing that stuff out. And so, yeah, so I'm going to be a busy bee this week. But um, anyways, let's see if we can catch Sean without a fun fact. All right, let's see if he's, I can hear the car. There he is. And he still has his blinker on. <laughs> you can do it. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Do you have a fun fact? Oh, you know, just that a uh, <sighs> at atmospheric river is a narrow uh, corridor of uh, moisture <laughs> in the atmosphere. Concentrated moisture in the atmosphere. And friends, we are currently experiencing. Yeah. You guys can't see. It's right. not. It's not focusing. Or AR for short. Atmospheric river. That's what we're experiencing here today. A narrow, narrow corridor of concentrated moisture in the atmosphere. There we go. Hey. We got there. I'm freaking tired, man. <laughs> yes, action. Uh, actually, and I got a bonus one. Yeah? It's time for what's least smell. It is! Let's do this! All right, friends, cast your votes. Oh, oh ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, hello, welcome to another episode of... <laughs> what's Lisa <laughs> smelling? Last one for 2021. Last one for 2021. We had a great year, you guys. Da, da, da. Now we should start keeping track, and then we could compare your stats. Maybe I'll do that when I got nothing to do for the couple weeks. Yeah. Da, 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 da. All right. Hello. Welcome back to everyone's favorite game. Uh, this is gonna be episode number 13 of What's Lisa Smelling? Ooh, that lucky was, 13. That is correct. That was Erica in the band. Erica. Erica. Thank you so much for showing up yeah. on Lucky December 13th. She, she killed it. She did great. Killed it. Very nice. Okay, uh, let's get to our first spot here. Our friends. We have new I friends. I feel like we're missing something. Did you miss something? I feel like you're doing something different. Okay. <laughs> Not that I know. I, got it. I mean, I have my <laughs> script right here. <laughs> he does have a script. <laughs> uh, yeah. Okay. Our, we have new friends this week. They, they pay, pay us, us no, no money, money to be here because they, they have, have no, no money. money. Our friends over at Strawbridge, Strawbridge <laughs> and Clother. Uh, Strawbridge and Clother, Clother, you'll see the difference. Mm, mm. Wow, so fancy. Yeah, they're over in, uh, it's like Pennsylvania-ish area. Nice. And uh, when did they begin their life? Uh, 1868. Wow. Yeah. And when did they end it? Uh, about 2006. Jeez. Another. Another victim of Macy's. Macy's, yeah. 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 It yeah. looks like a well, Macy's. Well, Macy's got, has it coming to them because... <laughs> Macy's has it coming, especially at Sunrise Mall. That's right. It's all you. That is right. Okay, let's uh, get to our viewer comment shtick. Let's do this it. This first one is a great reminder and a PSA. It is from our friend. <laughs> Amy and she says everyone hit that like button. Thank yeah. you so much, Amy. Yes, we appreciate it when you smash like, when you smash that like button, yep. that thumbs up button. We really appreciate it. Yep. And yeah, smash that bell and yep. everything. All so, of it. All of it. Because you don't want to miss what's S happening. Smash. Smash. That's what the kids are calling it. All right, next one is from our friend Monica. And Monica says, of course there's a FedEx truck taunting you on your trip, right? My thoughts exactly. Mm -hmm. In fact, we actually passed a FedEx truck today on our adventures, and I almost whipped out the camera and said, mm. still yeah, taunting. You were too busy waving with one finger. <laughs> <laughs> You're number one. <laughs> 
<laughs> okay, next one is from our friend Sherry. That, <laughs> that wasn't true. She didn't do it. Oh, no, I didn't do that. I promise. <laughs> I promise that. I don't do that. <laughs> you probably say, no, that didn't happen. <laughs> Instead, I just went with it. Yeah. Jeez. Right. Okay, this one's from our friend Sherry. And Sherry says, new viewer here from Calgary, Alberta, Canada. Thank you so Hello. much. Hello. Hello. All right. And pretty new to Sensi. I somehow found you on YouTube and have enjoyed you and Sean very much. Love going to Dallas with you as I have never been. Looked like a very fun Thanksgiving for you both. Have a great week and look forward to your next vlog. Thank you so Excellent. much. We really appreciate you wanting to hang out with us. Yeah. It, it means a lot. Very cool. A lot of people up there in uh, yeah. old Canada. Our friends to the north. Canada. Yeah. Okay. All right. I'm, this is what I was telling Sean. I feel like I'm either going to tank this or I am going to do amazing. Uh -huh. And he did say I didn't get any extra credit, so there's that. Yeah, because number one is so easy that it is. Is it, it though? It is extra credit. Is it though? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, so then can I have extra points for it since this, <laughs> it's, it's so easy? Is it worth two points? <laughs> Yeah, yeah, can we? Yeah. <laughs> no. Okay. All right. How are we gonna do? I honestly, I'm gonna do six for six. Are we gonna go six for six here today? Well, that's simple. Yes. Nice. <laughs> yes. There we go. It just says yes. Okay. All right. Okay. Well, I uh, hope everyone's enjoyed this. Stuff. <laughs> no point in doing this. We'll see you next year. <laughs> okay. Okay. Oh, oh, actually, I think I can do this with the pony because the pony is high and not yeah. high enough. Nice. I don't know why I do this to myself. Yeah, why do you? Why do I do this to myself? Oh this my much? goodness. All right. Oh jeez. Oh, the dramatics. That atmospheric yeah. river. Yeah, it really uh, turns out the old atmospheric river puts a shutdown on Ranger's bladder. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and, he, and someone has to be out. Are these sunglasses? No, you're good. Okay. Um, and someone has to be out there with him. <laughs> Not someone. Oh, me. Yeah. Sean, Sean's like, nope. <laughs> he's not gonna go he's not gonna go and i'm it. such a mom and i'm like okay go potty go potty I'm like mm -hmm. well you guys saw yeah well yeah hopefully you put that yeah we'll put see it in there all right oh it just fell that's okay oh bummer <laughs> okay okay finger nail count 13 13 is whoop, whoop. lucky 13 let's see here <sighs> okay are you ready to have some fun always let's have some fun always shall we ready. All right, Sweet plum pastry. All right, uh, here we go. <laughs> you said it was so easy. Number one, all right. Ah, Dumbo. Yes, indeed. Oh, Dumbo. My love. See how easy that was. Mm, can I have two points? <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> I mean, okay. We'll see. All right, number two. Because I think it would be cool if I got like seven points out of six. I feel like that would be really cool. Yeah. Oh, apples and oats. Wow. Woo! Is it? Yeah, it is. Yeah, yeah. it is. Two four two. Mm, it's so good and so sad it didn't come back this year, but it is in our club. Yes, it sure is. Yes, it sure is. I have a full list of everything in our club. Do you really? No. Good. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh, this is nice. Oh, this is nice. This is fruity. Oh, this is very fruity, and I love this. Oh man, what is this? This is. So good. <laughs> ah, it's so fruity. Mm, not rainbow sherbet, but it's like that kind of fruity. Like it is fruity. Mmm. Ah, what is this? It's not rainbow sherbet. I'm thinking like what's along that same line. Ah, gosh. It's almost like a, it's almost like a fruit punch kind of. Um, there might be like strawberries. This is really nice. Really nice. Do you like the? You love this. I really do. That is my jam. Indoor jelly. Mmm. This is so nice. <laughs> Um, fruity, 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 fruity. Um, not, it's not, is this, I don't think, is it perfectly pomegranate? No. Uh, yeah. No. Uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. mm, good golly, this is good. <laughs> this is so good. I'm going to say it's not available because this is so fruity in summertime. Sorry. I'm just going to have to come back to it. I feel like I'm going to get it. 
I just feel like I need to come back to it. Yeah, yeah I think so. All right. Oh, we're doing that. Okay. Yep. Uh -huh. All right, here we go. <gasps> Yay! Yay! You did give me extra credit. <laughs> Is this extra credit? Yes. Okay. Oh, um... Oh is this, boy. Is this missing? Hold on. <laughs> no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no! <laughs> There's only a handful of, well, I guess more than a handful, yes. different flavors. Don't, don't you judge me yet. Gosh, this is nice too. Um, it's not Pink Point Seta, is it? Yeah. Is it? Yeah, we'll go with that. Is it? Yep. What? And I thought, but I feel like this smells even better than Pink Poinsettia. Am I okay? Yep, you're good. Do you have a question? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for the extra credit. I appreciate it. You're very welcome. Ah, this one. I know this one. This is floral. Ah. Ah. Um, I, Bloom and Beach? No. Nope. I am going to get a shirt that says nope. Yeah. No. I, I don't, that's in the works. Yeah. I'm going to design that. <laughs> There's nothing really to design. Nope. But, <laughs> <laughs> nope. Uh, uh, yeah. We'll be doing that, I think, when you're recovering. Okay. Yeah. I know this. I don't think it's available. I also don't believe it's in our club. I'm okay with that. It's a, it's a nice floral, but it's not like earth shattering. And I'm sorry if this is like your favorite scent ever. Um, I just, I can't have all the bars in my club. Um, uh, and it also helps that I just went through all of my bars too. Um, is this, um, the freesia, uh, sweet, sweet amber freesia. Yes, it is. <gasps> Woo! Yeah. Woo! Nice. Yep, I'm gonna rock this. Nice. Definitely gonna rock it. I just have to come back to that. Yep. Fruity one. Two more to go. All right, here's number five. Thank you. Oh. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Yes. 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 Oh, this is real nice. <sighs> Hold on, but I got some floral on my nose but this is very nice. Ooh, ooh. It did something to me on the bottom. I know this. Oh man, I know this. Um I know this. Um, it's so nice. Um, tangerine creamsicle. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Woo! Woo! Which, by the way, does smell different than orange dream, uh, orange dreamsicle. Yes, this is true. You were just telling me last night they smell the same. No, I thought it's oh, cream stomach. Just, Did you hear my stomach? <laughs> yeah. It was like, hello! Yeah. Shirley's in the house! Shirley's in the house! Right. Shirley's hungry! Alright, number six. Number six, alright. Oh, oh, hold up. I know this. Oh my gosh, I know this. Oh my gosh, I know this. <laughs> oh my gosh, I know this! What is this? I know it! It's so obvious. There's nothing else that smells like this. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh. Like this is one I should get like right when I smell it. Hmm. But I'm not. Oh gosh. I know this. This is another fruity one. Yeah. Oh, I know this. Oh, you did good. You did good. 
I know, I really do know this. It's really fruity and it's really good. Ah, this is an, it, oh my gosh, this kind of smells like the other one. <laughs> but different. Oh gosh, it's so good. It's so fruity. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna kick myself if I don't get this. I think you could probably do that for both of them if you don't get it. Oops. Oh my gosh, I don't wanna come back to this because they both smell similar. This is not good. You, you are a bad man. Uh, uh, we're you're huh? doing great. I'm doing great. Did you just drop me a hint? Uh, no. Oh. Paid you a compliment. Thank you. I'm doing great. Oh no. It's so fruity. It's so nice. I did not pop this one out. No. Uh, this is the same one? This is the same one that we're returning to? Uh huh. Are you sure? I'm pretty sure. Uh, oh, you have all the other ones over there by you. Mm. Mm. I, I don't. Oh my gosh! I'm gonna kick myself! I know this. Mm -hmm. It's so fruity and nice. Mm. I'm sorry. Uh oh. Yeah. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh, hold on. You ready for the, the old. Uh... What are we doing? What are we doing? Nothing. Ready for the old skew? Yes. Where, where, what were you doing over over in the corner? No, I was just putting uh, something away. Oh. What were you putting away? Nothing. Uh, okay. You did say you're doing something you've never done before. Oh, yeah, this, well, I'll tell you after. Okay, for that skew. Well, I'm so confused. Four, okay. three, three, five, four. Four, three, three, five, four. Yes, it smells like four, three, three, five, four. Yes. Would you like to put that down for a second? Oh, yeah, sorry. And put your hands out. Put my hands out? Yeah. Yes. See? <laughs> Man! I was like, it's so fruity! I mean, technically it's a fruit. Technically. technically it's a fruit. Technically. Because it has a seed. It does have orange in here, too. Valencia orange. Okay. Season. God! Mm. I should have had that. Yeah, you're good. It's right down there. So, did I get a, a partial point? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, absolutely. <laughs> I mean. Absolutely. What do we even do? All right, here? here's number six. <sighs> the one that smells like nothing else. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> mm, I know this. I know it. <sighs> I do know this. Okay. I believe. I believe. I believe. I believe. I believe. I believe. It is either. <sighs> It is so nice, um, but it has hit me. I believe it's either the Muppets bar. Is it the Muppets? No. <clears throat> is it Looney Tunes? Yes, it is. <laughs> yeah! Boom. Woo, woo, woo! Okay, I am definitely kicking myself for sea salt and avocado, but. Come on back to us now. Come on back. I will. <laughs> Thank you so much. Woo! Nice. Party time. Oh my gosh. Yeah, sea salt. Oh, right. sea salt and avocado. Oh my god. Definitely available. 
<laughs> I know. I was like, it's not a vampire. <laughs> What? Did I say it smelled like fruit punch? I think it is. Yeah, that the one that I said smelled rainbow, like fruit punch? Rainbow sherbet. And... Yeah, that's no problem. That's no problem. You still got six out of six. Oh my goodness. Well, I did. Yes, I did. Thank you for the extra credit. <laughs> Man, I really want to get seven out of six. One of these times. <sighs> well, that was nice. Thank you. You're very welcome. That's the last one for 2021. Well, let's get to our second set of three comments. Let's do it. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, okay, second set of three comments. This one's from our friend Amy. <clears throat> Amy says, I smell furniture polish, Windex, and Pine Sol. Pine Sol. I love how that. I, see, I'm... I, that was for the up, right? Yes, yeah. the up bar, yeah. yeah. I, I might be crazy, but it's okay. I still I still need to warm it, and I still want to. Yeah. I just get Pine Sol and Windex. Well, we'll see. There it is. Okay, next one is from our friends Kimberly and Paul. Uh, they say you are amazing and congratulations on moving. Thank you so very much. Well, you two are amazing. You two are amazing. Thank you very much. Okay, and last one for 2021, Whoa. last featured comment for the year. It's from our friend Brianna, and she says, congratulations on getting out of California and best wishes for your fresh start in Idaho in 2022. Lisa, I'm hoping for a smooth surgery and recovery and that you both are able to enjoy your Christmas. Thank you so very much. I yeah. think it's going to be very enjoyable. Yeah, very nice. Thank you very much. Thank you so, so much. Let's get to our oh, second yeah, spot here. That's right. They still have no money because they are belly up. <laughs> our friends over at Strawbridge and Clother. Strawbridge and Clother. You'll see the difference. I actually have an additional photo. Oh, you do? So that's one of the, it might be the original oh. one. It's wow. now an Outback. I see that. Yeah. And guess what city that's in? Salt Lake City, Utah. No, I said Pennsylvania. Jenkins. Oh. <laughs> That's Jenkintown, oh, Pennsylvania. Wow. Home oh, yeah, of the you, did, you did say. You JTP. Did. JTP. 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 Yeah. <laughs> For the Goldbergs. The Goldbergs. Yeah, the JTP. Oh, my gosh. Anyway. That's All so right, funny. Jenkintown. Shout out to Jenkin Jenkintown. Woo -woo. We have any viewers from Jenkintown. Shout out. Shout us out. Let us know. Holler. All right. Holla. <laughs> Holla at your berries. All right. Uh, Eddie and the band, take us away. Eddie and the band. Whoop, whoop. That's it for 2021, folks. Adios. All right, we are all done with what's Lisa smelling for the year <laughs> now, um, but we are gonna get ready for dinner. We're just doing leftover tacos for dinner tonight, so nice and easy. We like nice and easy, um, and then and then I'm gonna show you one of the things that came in the mail today that I'm really super excited about. I may even do a little demonstration. We shall see. But first, we're gonna whip together our tacos and show them how cute Zoe is. I know, I have to show, she's so cute. Just don't make any sudden movements. She's so cute. Are you hogging all the toys? <laughs> Are you, she says yes, <laughs> maybe. Are you hogging all the toys? <laughs> yep, proud of it. <laughs> all right, friends, leftover taco night is underway. We've got Sean's situation here. I know this looks exactly the same as it always does, but here we have it. Um, and that, well, this looks different. <laughs> so I've got my little street tacos with my corn tortilla shells. Um, and then I made myself a little quesadilla because we ran out of meat. So we've got that. It's good. It's great. We're excited. We're hungry. Let's eat. Hey friends. Happy Tuesday. I didn't pick up the camera again last night as you guys can obviously see. <laughs> um, after dinner, I was just busy packing up orders and stuff that I need to get out, um, this week. I'm really hoping I can get most of them out um between today and like tomorrow probably um so i was just kind of busy with that so i didn't wind up picking up the camera again there wasn't really anything super exciting for you guys to see but um i've already been up to ups once today um got a lot of boxes out which is great um but i decided to treat myself and i wanted to show you what i'm treating myself with so I decided to treat myself to some hot chocolate bombs. I know these are not like a new thing, but I've never had them. So I'm going to go ahead and treat myself. So I just got these on Amazon. I know that there's like a million and one different um, hot chocolate bombs out there, uh, but I wanted to show you what I got. So <clears throat> these have two different flavors. So there's a fudge brownie and a caramel candy hot chocolate. Mm hmm. So let's uh, give this a try here. Let me show you what they look like. So they look really pretty too. Look really pretty. So, all right, let's give this a try. Okay, so we are gonna do the fudge brownie is what we're going to do here. Let's see if I can not spill everywhere. 
I just heated up some milk. Now we have hot cocoa. Mm-hmm, I'm just excited, it's fun. There go all the marshmallows. <laughs> so I'm gonna treat myself to some hot cocoa while I continue working on some boxes and things. You can catch me in a little bit. Okay, for reals though, you guys, this hot cocoa is so good. <laughs> it is so good. I love it. Now I am no like hot cocoa guru or anything. So if you are picky about your hot cocos, this may not be amazing to you, but this is amazing to me. I love it. And it's super fun to watch anyway. So um, highly recommend. I'm definitely going to hop on Amazon and order a couple more because <laughs> seriously, so good. So yummy. And I know I'm going to want to reach for this um, while I'm cozy and recovering uh, after surgery, which by the way, officially one week countdown. I'm hoping here, so what time is it? It is 10.03 and I am hoping that this time next week, I'm gonna be out, out in surgery. So that's what that's what the hope is. We'll see. All right, I'm gonna get to work. I'll check in with you guys in just a little All right, bit. friends, it is so much later in the day now. It is actually just about six o'clock. Sean is home. We had leftover chili for dinner, and now we're just gonna kind of chill and hang out for the night. Um, it was just kind of a busy day, which is why I didn't pick up the camera too terribly much. Um, UPS runs, uh, local deliveries, and just running errands and stuff like that. So it was just kind of a busy day, and then now, oh my gosh, it's evening. <laughs> <laughs> these days just fly by like crazy but i didn't want to forget to close out the vlog with you guys thank you so so much for hanging out with us this weekend we appreciate the love and support so much if you're new please subscribe if you're already subscribed be sure to hit the notification bell that way you stay up to date with everything we are up to um as we mentioned a few times in this vlog this is going to be the last vlog for a couple of weeks um but we will definitely be back so hang tight we will be back to the usual of course, Zoe has to be drinking right now. <laughs> we will be back to the weekend vlogs as soon as we can. So thank you so much for the love and support. We'll see you in the next vlog. Have a merry, merry Christmas and the happiest of New Year's. We love you guys and can't wait to check in with you in 2022. Bye guys. The snow is falling down. I've been longing for this Christmas. When everyone's around to share this holiday. Yes, it's a time of happiness, a time of joy But now this year is twice as special Cause I'm hoping for us to fall in love In this winter wonderland Chilling by the fire As I'm trying to get your attention Giving you a smile I can sing to look away
up joy But now this year is quite so special Cause I'm hoping for that we'll fall in love in this wind 